Although there's just one mile per gallon difference between all train and mud train tires of same size, there's still a lot of gap between these two. So Nitto jumped in and filled it up with its grappler family. There are some key differences in all these tires. But first, let's get the basics out of our way. Rule is, the more aggressive the tire gets, the more off-road capability the tire has. And they get aggressive in the following order. We have Terra, then comes Recon, then Ridge, and in the end we have Trail Grappler. The Terra Grappler is simply an all-train tire, while the Trail Grappler, being the most aggressive with widest block valleys, is a mud train tire. Now here, sitting in the middle, the Ridge and Recon are both hybrid tires. A hybrid is simply a mixture of two tires, where the Ridge Grappler has a mud tire's shoulders while its middle stays all-terrain with compact blocks arrangement. The Recon, on the other hand, is a combination of Toyo Open Country RT and the Nitto Ridge Grappler. And if you are wondering what's Toyo doing here, they are both part of the same company, ran by same people, and looking at their design, it really makes sense. Let's check out all of these tires one by one. Starting with Nitto Terra Grappler G2, which is its second generation and now comes with updated design. And besides new looks, the tire provides better traction on snow and is quieter on roads. With bigger central rib, the tire offers more contact with the road, so they provide more grip as well. But the Thunderbolt Lightning Siping, visible on all of its blocks, is still not that effective as the tire tends to slip and lose traction in wet conditions. The tire, however, still performs good off-road, with notches and incisions facing in all directions. These notches also face the ones on the shoulder blocks, which are staggered and form jagged circumferential outer grooves. The tire actually has four of these circumferential channels, while the outer two more prominent and wider. Moving on to the Nitto Recon Grappler, with these newest tire, Nitto is able to bridge the gap between the Terra and Ridge Grappler, so they come right in the middle in terms of aggressiveness. The tires provide some unique features and are one of the first to come with Nitto's warranty of 50,000 miles. Comparing the Nitto Recon, Bridge and Terra, they all include dual sidewalls and variable pitch technology. With dual sidewalls, they have two different designs on each side of the tire and variable pitch technology ensures that they are quieter on road. But here, the Terra, unlike others, offer better snow traction with its 3 big mountain snowflake rating. But the tire is less durable with just two ply sidewalls, where Nitto Ridge and Recon provides three ply construction. Inner construction of Nitto Recon consists of three ply polyester casing having two high tensile steel belts, which are then wrapped with two layers of nylon, just like the Nitto Ridge. In terms of performance, Recon Grappler provides better on-road experience than the Ridge and at the same time, they also offer you with greater off-road performance if you compare them with the Terra Grappler. The tire basically provides you with an aggressive design without compromising too much on-road comfort. The staggered shoulder blocks are scalloped and have reinforced foundations where no stone injectors are embedded and instead they have ridges in between. This forms an aggressive shoulders and at the same time lock the movement of the blocks so they are also great in on-road handling. But since the tire shoulders come into play on corners, Recon, with its minimal design, also provides good on-road grip but suffers a little bit on wet roads. So on its shoulder blocks, there isn't too much going on. However, the central area of the tire is totally different. It's separated by wide circumferential channels and it shows versatile thread pattern with a combination of sharp lateral grooves and a mixture of wide and narrow sides. The blocks form a somewhat triangular shaped pattern and make zigzag lateral grooves which joins the outer channels. All of them provide a decent path for water, dirt and mud to pass through. So can these tires outperform Nitto Ridge? Well, Ridge Grappler is another hybrid which is built on all-terrain platform but it's still more aggressive than the Recon Grappler. 
The tire features boulder stone injectors and bulkier sidewall lugs and this combined with its softer material, the tire is able to perform better off-road. And although the tire has same three-ply sidewalls, these bulkier lugs further protect the tire against sharper objects. Other than this, the tire features slanted Z-shaped grooves in the middle and bigger staggered shoulder blocks. All of them make wider channels so more volume of mud, water and dirt can pass through. Meanwhile, the sharp triangular blocks with notches are able to cut through all sorts of trains. Each block in the middle also comes with a foundation underneath. And besides making stepped edges which provide biting to the ground, they also make angle variations which helps dampening the noise levels. Nitto calls it the variable pitch technology. But the tire is still louder than the other two. And also with minimal siping, the tire just like the Recon Rappler does not come with 3 peak mountain snowflake rating. Moving on to our last tire, the Nitto Trail Grappler, which is a mud train tire designed not for just mud, but all kinds of off-road trains. The tire offers a straightforward and open design, where central area contains two blocks forming Y channels in between. And on sides, you see serrated shoulders with blocks that are divided with deep incisions. These blocks then extend to the sidewalls and provide you with the biggest lugs in the grappler family. Overall, these tires are not designed for roads, so they are pretty noisy compared to others. They also have softer rubber which wears faster on roads. And with minimal siping, the tire has the least traction on wet pavements. But at the same time, the softer compounds stick better off-road and the durable 3-ply polyester construction protects the tire from unwanted objects. So, if you are mostly staying off-road, you can consider these tires. Otherwise, Terra, Recon and Ridge Grappler go from least to most aggressive. So, you can choose any of these according to your needs. Please hit the like button if you enjoy our video and please subscribe for our upcoming ones. Till next time.